I thought that I was fluent in English, but when I came here, I realized that I wasn't, so I had to start from the bottom. Well, that's a Pacifica High School student describing her path to graduation when her family moved to America just a few years ago. Today, she is graduating at the top of her class. Her story is our top story at 4 o'clock. Good evening, everybody. I'm C.J. Ward. And I'm Beth Farnsworth. We are on early this afternoon for Game 6 of the NBA Finals. We begin with a major milestone for one local student. She left Mexico for America when she was just 15, not having one friend, and she certainly didn't know the language as well as she thought. Now she's graduating as valedictorian. News Channel 3, Senator De Los Santos joins us live from the ceremony with this inspiring story. Senator yeah, that's right, guys. You know, the graduation just kicked off here at Pacifica High School. Now, one valedictorian will be giving a speech just four years after she first walked on campus, not able to speak English fluently. Angeles Montavo took one final walk around campus before graduation day at Pacifica High School in Oxnard. So is this an A for um, A in all your classes or for Angeles? For Angeles. <laughs> she is graduating top of her class as one of 11 valedictorians. But how she got here wasn't easy. At the beginning, it was difficult. When Angeles was 15, her family decided to pack their things and leave Mexico after a violent incident. My dad was kidnapped. Uh, for a couple of hours and after that he was really scared of going out so our lives changed completely and then his comp the company that he worked for offered him an opportunity to work here. Angela has had to say goodbye to her friends and life as she knew it including learning a new language as she started her freshman year. I thought that I was fluent in English but when I came here I realized that I wasn't so I had to start from the bottom. I had to start we're like learning like, hello, my name is, and the colors, and all that kind of stuff. And it was like, I felt kind of dumb, but I knew that it was going to be good for me. She enrolled in English language development classes, and as her English improved, she began to excel academically, soon transitioning from ELD to college prep classes, and eventually joining Pacifica's Academy of Business. I look at grades, and I started looking at her grades, and I started see, to notice that you know, consistently she had all A's. She finished all four years of high school with a 4.0 and ranked number one in her class. I really never thought that I was able to do something like that. I think that I'm very proud of myself. It's very rare for a student, for a newcomer to be a valedictorian. Um, I've been a high school counselor for like about 15 years now. I've only seen it twice. I don't know how my life would have been, maybe if I, would have been able to go to college or something. So, yeah, I really feel like it was a blast to come here. Now, Angeles plans to attend Cal State Channel Islands, where she also says that she wants to major in business and plans to hold down a job to cover the cost. She also tells me that her and her family were here on a working visa, but they have recently applied uh, for a residency, permanent residency, that is, and they plan to meet with their attorney next week. For now, I'm live in Oxnard at Pacifica High School's graduation. Senator Los Santos, News Channel 3.